That happens some 500 times. Uske baad I'm like, behen, calm down. It's not going to be like this. But I think the, the turning point truly, I would say, was scam. Because, you know, country saw scam, which is a big deal. But uh, now, whatever will happen will be because of Chup. The only thing I wish I could change, I still wish changes in the industry, is the right to fight for an opportunity should be available and equal to all. It doesn't happen. Hi, my name is Shreya Dhanvantri and you're watching me on peepingmoon.com. Time to be chub because uh, we are celebrating Shreya Dhanvantri in all its glory and let's talk to somebody who is right now the talk of the town. So welcome Shreya to Peeping Moon. Thank you, thank you for having me. <laughs> Am I supposed to be chup or are we supposed to? No, 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 please. Say whatever you want. <laughs> so how does it feel to come freshly out of a success which in a time where we all have been talking about that, having a steady theatrical run and then being able to make, not just being a successful theatrical run, but being able to recognize for the work you're doing and everyone raving about it. I didn't expect it, honestly, Ankita. I am so happy i'm so kicked that people have not only responded to the film but they've responded to all of us and they've responded to me in particular and i mean we just wanted people to see the film you know we just hoped obviously we go into a project hoping for the best case scenario hoping for well people to like it to watch it because that's another tension people are having in the theaters so yeah the, the fact that people went saw liked it's pretty, it's pretty cool. Shreya, if I have to journey ko trace back karna, do you think? No, don't do it. No, I have to. <laughs> if I have to say that, what, almost a decade plus? Yeah, yeah. Almost ten years. a decade yeah. plus. So what started as a Miss India finalist? That I'm not going to talk about. I have nothing nice to say about that. But, but I started with, uh, yeah, like modeling with Down ads. Down South, and I think that, that's... So Down South also, is, that's, I did a film when I was like 18, when I was in college, I was... Studying, I mean, I was doing so my... like an in-between kind of thing. No, while engineering, I used to go finish that, take a leave and do all, yeah, I somehow managed that, was full jugaad. But, uh, yeah, that was the, I should give full credit to that. Though it's a disservice to my sweet Telugu audiences ki, I wasn't very good. So, please don't go back and see it. I will hopefully do better for you. But, uh, yeah, that was the thing that made me go, ah, ye actually karna hai. Like, ye actually pursue karna hai. So that was, I should give credit to that. Then it was advertisements. Then I think it, I was the brand ambassador for Amazon Prime Video to come to India. Then people saw, then that translated into something, something, something. Then I did my first film that nobody saw. And then Family Man came. <laughs> then Scam happened, then Mumbai Diaries. And Loop Lapeta and but Chup. If you have, what was that uh, one defining moment if I have to ask you? That was the reason I asked this question. Do you recall the moment where you knew that my career is redefined? Or I actually want to do it, that is acting, leaving the engineering. Kid, yeah, I used to feel that with every job actually. Such me. I used to feel like, oh, okay, this is the ad that is going to change. Oh, this is the thing that is going to change. So that happened some 500 times. After that, I'm like, behen, calm down. <laughs> it's not going to be like this. But I think the, the turning point truly, I would say, was scam. Because, you know, country saw scam, which is a big deal. But uh, now, whatever will happen will be because of Chup. Sure, do you think that this, the profession you are in, like acting as we call it, and you are one of the few artists we have who are simultaneously balancing between OTT and a theatrical. You consider yourself as a profitable artist because OTT outings are also working well and so are the theatricals? I mean, I would like to rudely take claim for this but yeah, I mean, it's it's pretty cool that uh, stuff that I've done so far. I mean, I have been a part of things that haven't worked also. But the, I mean, Family Man and Scam and Mumbai Diaries have been massive. And Chup has done so well, which is so cool. <laughs> so no, I'm really grateful. Uh, Shia, tell me something. Uh, if you have to go back in time by chance and fix one of the projects of yours, because you really waited for, if I'm BS Tracing, Scam has one of your breakthroughs. Then so I took have, a while. Yeah, and you have done enough work also before that. Yeah. But do you think if you had to change anything before that, do you have to change? I don't know, yeah. I'm very nervous about what-if scenarios. Ki, you know, pass me ja ke agar if you change something. I don't know if things would happen the way it happens. I don't think I want to change it. 
I mean, I want her, but I don't want her. If it if it makes sense. It makes sense. Yeah, because, because I want to. Because obviously, come on, you don't have to wait for this long. But I don't want to. But because then I don't know where your life would have reached. Yeah. So, kinda yes, kinda no. <laughs> Bombay is a tough place to survive. Of course, yeah. it is. For anyone, especially who is not coming with a certain background, to you know have holding their hand. No, 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 no comparison for sure. Doing, doing it. Was it every time you wanted to give up? Every day. <laughs> Then what no, but I'll tell you honestly, it is because our pro our situation is not even that. Because some of us have not, have come from outside of the city, outside of the state. Some of us have come outside of the country. I have come outside of the country. Yes. So, so our problems are not even related to the industry. Our problems are first rent, like place, locality, landlords, bills. So you solve all of that. It's like. I was, telling, I was telling my friends the other day, I was like, I have 99 problems and, you know, film is not one of them. Because it doesn't come in the first 100. Mein. So it comes later. I'd... So, yeah, it is. It's not easy. And honestly, when when you ask me how, I, I don't know, yeah. I don't know. It's a very useless, helpless answer, I'm sure. I'm sorry. But uh, I don't know. I think I have to be a little crazy to, to want to stick it out every day despite hearing no's, despite... Uh, things not going the way you hoped they would. It's, uh, yeah, I think I might, I'm a little crazy. But were there auditions or parts? There are days I saw like, I'm just, this part is mine. I'm almost there. Yeah. I can crack it, but. Every, again, see, you ask any one of us, all of our answers will be the same. It's true. It happened so many times. It happened so many times that I feel, I know I'll be good for this. Even now, I feel like, oh my God, I know I could have done this or this better or that, whatever. But uh, in the end, you have to be okay with the fact that there are some things that are meant for you, that will be yours no matter what, and there are some things that are meant for other people. Well, in the pandemic, I sound very zen now, but bahut roya mein. This zen also, I think, comes after when bahut ek ek lamba period aap us cheez se nikal chuke hote that you calm yourself down. Ah, nee nee. See, that's what I'm making myself sound cooler. If this happens tomorrow, like if I want to get some job that I really want or a part that I really want to play and I don't get it, I'm still going to cry. It's still going to be brutal. My family and friends will hear about it. I will cry about it for one or two weeks constantly and I will complain about it for two months. And then when Ankita will come and ask me this question, I'll be like, no, no, it's okay. You have to be okay with these things. This, this is the crap that will happen. <laughs> <laughs> but I like the crap, no matter what. It's the truth, unfortunately. Sure, pandemic ke time pe while people were talking about content and changing, I really have to bring it because this is something personally I loved. You came with a viral wedding. Something yes. Something you made, directed, produced. Viral acted, wedding. And it was, as Shreya was telling me, it was a delectable snack time watch. Yeah, chai time. Chai time watch. Hmm. What's happening with that? Are you trying to don the director's or producer's heart? Oh, no, no. Me? See, I've always uh, written. I've always been a writer of some sort. So this happened because Raj and DK were very encouraging to do something, if you're, you know, why not like just make something happen. And we were one of the first people to make something from start to finish in the pandemic, really? in the world. world. In the world. We were so, because we were up for a Guinness Book World of Record, this is true. And uh, Guinness in the end, because there was a, we were in contention with another program on ITV in UK or BBC, okay. something. But they had professional equipment. We were in the house with mobiles. Oh. So they didn't quite know how to judge the parameters. Judge the pa parameters. So they scrapped the category. But yeah, we were up for a world record, which would have been so cool that we did get. But yes, that, that happened. But yeah, viral wedding, again, thanks to Raj and DK. So. Is it getting viral again? Abby? Oh, I don't know if it is. But I'm so glad that, that you actually remember and you like it and you brought it up. Of course. That's pretty cool. That's but that's the thing, yeah. I mean, you make it so that people like it and enjoy it. And it's it's a weird, it's a such a different kind of kick when people actually like what you do. And you have the recall value. I think that that's one of the biggest, uh, I would say, accomplishments for any artist. Ki if your work can be recalled time and again and people love you for the parts you have played. Yeah. But can that also be a trapping in your case in an artist's life? So for not for me, because with Chup, it was such an interesting story. Balki... This is a very famous story because he's uh, talked about it in interviews as well. We all have. And this is one of my favorite stories. So, Balki wanted two girls for the part. For the lead role in uh, Chup. So, uh, I, after I met and he offered me the film and he's like, if you want it, it's yours. I'm like, yeah, I want it. It's yours. So, it, I get out of the room. And then he says, uh, yeah, I had two girls in mind for the film. I mean, I met Shreya. She's great. But I, I, I wish I met the other girl as well. 
and the writer was in the room when he said this. So he was like, sir, can I ask you if you don't mind who the other girl was? And he says, yeah, so one is the new girl from Scam and the other is the new girl from Family Man. <laughs> I swear, this really happened. He did not know. And then the writer was like, sir, dono ek hi hai, wahi hai. And then he's like, oh, achha, the money said, this is true. <laughs> this is the most coolest tour. This is the coolest heard. tour. I'm, I swear, this really happened. So he had no idea. So I don't think I have a problem of being typecast because people don't recognize me from the different things I've done. That's, that's, that's probably one of the coolest things. It's the sure. coolest thing. <laughs> Shen, this decade long journey of yours as a performer, as an artist, what are the things you felt you needed to fight for and you did? Or something you just let go by a little too easily? Uh, no, I think generally, I think all of us, people who genuinely, like you said, very rightfully, people who come here with no help. No help. Whatsoever. whatsoever. No connection, no help. I, the only thing I wish I could change, I still wish changes in the industry, is the right to fight for an opportunity should be available and equal to all. It doesn't happen. Okay, tell me, on a fun, on a lighter note, is there a part you really wanted to play and you know you could have done it? So but many, but I can't reveal the names, but so many. In a fun, good zest, one part you think you would have loved, you would also done an equal good job. No, no, really, so many. Give me a name. I can't. Oh my God. Because there's so many because I genuinely think I would have done a good job because they're, I don't know, they're very specific parts that I know are, like I can give life to. That I know that are so me. I'll change the question thing. for you. If there's a part you're dying to play, is there something, a character, a character sketch in mind? So I have a genre, yaar, Ankit, honestly. Because I have, uh, because there's such different audiences for different, because I have very close friends. My sister and I, we love horror films. Yeah, we love, we love horror films. Like if it really scares us, we're like, yeah, maza gaya. My mom can't tolerate it. Can't? Same. So that's what I'm saying. So there are different genres for different films, right? Mm -hmm. So I want to be able to do different genres. So I can touch like different, What's different audiences. Line? Horror. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I am not. Take it back. <laughs> <laughs> I am not coming to that one. <laughs> sure, for anyone who's dreaming big to be here in this industry today mm -hmm. and who's watching you, What's that one piece of advice you have to take at home? I'm going to be useless here. But make sure you really, you really, really love what you, you know, is asked of you. Like you really love acting or you like film, you like editing, writing, whatever it is. Make sure that it is something that is like your lifeblood. Because if you don't really like it, if you don't really want to do this, place is not easy. I think in your words, it will you destroy have to be you. Pagal enough you have to be a little pagal, yeah. I really think. You really have to want it that much that you don't want anything else. Unless that happens, I don't think this city, I don't think this industry will let you live in peace. Tell me an actor you're dying to work with. An actor I'm dying to work with? No, I have director's list. I actors, anybody actor. would be. Actors, really, I could like. It doesn't matter. It would be a privilege to be with everybody. Directors know. Yeah, give me top three. These are the easiest ones. No, no, because I feel like, okay, I'll tell you honestly, I feel like I'll jinx it. That's why I don't want to say it like loudly. Then give me actors. We are not jinxing it because you're okay working with all the actors. So, yeah. Okay, easy. You, something you think you look really cool with. Someone? Someone will, you will look really cool with. Okay, wait. I feel like energy wise, I think uh, Ranveer Singh and I have like mental levels of energy. We do, we do. I have been told by many people. I was coming to Haan, that. So we have like... Zada huh? I, I think it'll be bad for other people. We'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I don't know. But, but lastly, if I... Uh, Chef, you have to sum up today when you are here in the middle of all the arc lights and the glam and people dying to talk to you. No, 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 I feel like I've just entered. I don't have any of this yet. Okay, fine, scrapping that. But if today you're sitting here, we are talking to you, celebrating your success, is there somebody you want to give credit to, to where you are today? Somebody who actually was there for you with, who nobody's aware of to hold your hand and to make, tell you that, listen, yeah, you can go through Actually, this. it's so funny. Every time I have genuinely come close to quitting, like I told you, I was joking mm -hmm. about the fact that I thought about it every day. But there have been some points where I have genuinely come close, like, yeah, maybe this is not for me. I tried. Maybe I should, I should genuinely, I don't know, go back, do GMAT, do MBA, all of that. No, really, that was my original plan. Engineering ke baad, uh, MBA karna hi tha. I was like, okay, chalo, I can go back. Even not, like, forget it. But no, every, 
No, like till before scam came out, my parents were still telling me, listen, it's not too late, do GMAT. <laughs> <laughs> then <laughs> scam, <laughs> ah, then scam release, they're like, ah, okay, okay. <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, but every single time I've actually really come close to, maybe considering, not actually, but considering that, okay, maybe I should really start thinking about what to do next. I've always had somebody who said, are you mad? This is going to happen. Like it's going to happen. You have to. You have to stay. And I've had different, different people tell me that at different I points of time. For sure. Like for Family Man, it's genuinely Rajan DK because that time was a very low point. They are the reason why they convinced me to stay on. They're like, are you mad? No way. Really. So with that, and then there's so many other people. Like there was Atul Kas Baker. There was Hansal Mehta. There were. Nikhil Advani, so many people, yeah. I think the makers in your life have really paid, played a lovely part. Yeah, and then no, there are a lot of my friends also, like Sharib and uh, Sunny and Rajiv. There's so many people who would be like, are you mad? Why are you thinking like this? So, so lastly, tell me, before we sign off, if given the chance, would you trade off to be a director than an actor? I, th I think you'll make a good one. Sure, yeah. Why not? Why not? Yeah. And is there an immediate story in your mind to tell? No, no, I have loads of stories, but uh, sure, why not? Well, never say never because after Chuk, you never know, Shreya might surprise you with writing something else and I'm really waiting for a while, waiting to one. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I, let's see, I'll try. Never say never. <laughs> never say never, never, say that's never. true. <laughs> but thank you, this was, this was thank this you. fun and I hope by next time see you, we can have more meat on what I really need to discuss with her. Yes, yes. Yes. <laughs> but thank you so much for doing that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.